Hey guys, real quick before we get started, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy what I'm doing. It really helps me out, gives me the confidence to keep going, and yeah, I'll see you in the video. What is up and welcome back to a brand new video. Previously on Vikings, we just absolutely cut a massive swath through Germany on both of its continents, and while we might not control Berlin, uh, we do have Germany's most important cities, with Heidelberg coming under our control in the next few turns or so. Now, um, I gave it a lot of thought, and, well, I told you guys in the last video, the city of, um, this city right here is not going to be able to fall to us. We have, like, yeah, we're only gonna have, like, one person attacking. They have a crossbowman in the city, uh, they're probably gonna have walls soon. And Scythia is attacking. So, I mean, if Scythia does something, we will try to take that city. But I think the next best thing is to go for Poland and knock them out completely. We are stronger than Poland. Poland does have crossbowmen and walled cities, though. So that's definitely a problem. Um, forms a fleet. Give me that shit. I'll take that any day. Um, who should I upgrade? Eh, it doesn't really matter. Everybody just heal, fortify, promote, do all that good stuff. Um... I'm not at war with the Maori, no, so we're fine. Uh, we're still in that emergency. Yeah, there's no way we do anything over there. We're going to back up. Um, we have these horsemen over here. We have a battering ram as well. I think a few catapults, and we should be able to start going for their cities. I mean, they're not strong cities. like 36 combat strength. Krakow's 43. Uh, we don't need to take all of Poland, obviously, but if we could just take a nice good amount of it, that would be music to my ears. Now, um, you can attack, you're almost fully healed, and you can promote. Why would you attack from the- oh my god, that's the dumbest horseman. Why would you attack from the ocean, you dumb- f mm. Okay, um, I think we can still take the city, though, it's just a waste of- Can we? Yeah, there we go. Okay, much better. I'm gonna keep the city, obviously, and look at that. I love being in a golden age with everybody else in a dark age. It makes things so much simpler. Um... We'll go for, I guess, a Nobelisk, I guess. I mean, I, I don't know. I, we do have almost enough faith to rebuy our hero, Beowulf. And that's really good. He has 60 melee strength, and his charge ability is absolutely beautiful. We're definitely going to go for Beowulf. Um, this might be actually the last series I'm going to use heroes with, because it just makes everything so much easier. For the last, um, I don't know. I played Heroes Mode twice right now, and as of right now, nobody's claimed any other heroes in either series. This one or the England one, I think it was. So, it does kind of feel like cheating. Um, I'll play it for the rest of this game because it's fun as fuck. Um, but yeah, I feel like it's just a little bit too easy. The AI is too stupid to use these dudes. So, it's just like... Eh. Last time I'm going to use this, and oh my god, they're actually going for mains. Um, I could buy a catapult, though. I don't have a catapult. Shit, okay. How do I get a catapult? How long will it take? Uh, about four turns? We can hold out for that long. I think what we should do right now is just go for Poznan. It has no wall, so it should be a little bit easier. Um, but first things first, we're going to give everybody some sweet, sweet promotions. You can come here, and there we go. You can promote to... Ah, I should have given him the combat bonus against crossbowmen. Um, I don't think these cities are going to fall. Ah, well, well, well. Um, they might fall. Where's Nuremberg? Nuremberg's over there. They're not going to take Nuremberg. There's no way they take Nuremberg. Uh, this Viking longship. What am I going to do with the rest of my fleet? Oh, there's a city down there I wanted to take a look at. Oh, that's a free pikeman. Give me that shit. Um, Taruga. Oh, yeah, it's already surrounded. Thank you. Um... We'll leave these guys healing for a bit. This city has loyalty issues. Although we could always put a diplomat in there. Um, we'll see. I mean, if we take the city, that's four population. It might be enough. Um, I doubt it, but it's like, eh. eh. Oh my god, that's not going to be good. Barbarians at the gates again. I'm going to just harvest this resource to get this guy at like four population. Um, hmm. They have pikemen now. Uh, yeah, it's time. Uh, as much as I'd love to buy a catapult, and I still think I can, I have to get a horseman in this city. And then this city, ugh, the crossbowman's just, okay, you move here and attack because that's a promotion, 
and then you can go for another horseman i really wanted the catapults but i gotta protect these cities uh mexico city actually you can go for that the settler knows where to go um we're bringing in the archers all right it's fine keep going keep coming and i guess we'll also bring in the horsemen they get here fairly fast so maybe they'll be able to help um City's at 36 combat strength. The pikeman's going to make quick work of that, though, so we do have to deal with him first. Um, yeah, <laughs> what's this trireme think he's doing? Uh, let's get rid of the pikeman just so we can get a much better peace deal when we make peace with them. Um, we can move here and sort of surround the city. Uh, what is what is you? What's your passive ability? Classical and medieval era. Is that a classical era long shot? I think it's not. It's definitely ancient era. It says forms a fleet. So I'm going to come here. I'm going to form a fleet with this promoted dude. 45 combat strength. We'll give him one last turn to heal. And then next turn we can attack the city. Uh, everybody just stay healing. We'll go next turn. Yeah, this the city does fall. Uh, I think it actually falls this turn. I don't think... The pikeman has 41 base strength. I think we have to let the city fall. Um, we can always retake it fairly easily. These archers are all actually almost to the last promotion. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, we'll bring in our own units. Uh, you can actually promote. You move here. Bring in everybody, I guess. Uh, it's going to take us a while to get catapults anyway. Um, over here, I... You need an industrial zone. Your production is god-awful. Um, over here in Christian... Damn, what are all these boats doing here? Uh, let's get a harbor in this city. Is eh, meh. Let's do it. That's a farm. Over here, this horseman just spawned. We can... You actually get a promotion. No, nope, you don't. Fuck. Okay. Um, Vilnius is our ally, I think. So, yeah. You move here and attack him. Okay, Poland's going to take the city, but I will be able to hit him with two horse units next turn. We can come here. Okay. Um, oh, can we attack the city? Yes, we can. Bring in the big boy over here. Boom. Boom. Um, hmm, promotions. Promotions. I'm not going to attack with this guy because I don't want Scythia to snipe the city. Uh, we'll go for some crab turtles over there. Um, you can just... I guess you could come up north. Uh, we'll try garrisoning in that city, actually. Yeah, the city's gone. They took the city of Mainz. It sucks. Um, doesn't really matter, though. We should be able to get it back fairly quickly. Um, okay, yes, you hit him. You get promoted. Um, you can go there. Ah, that's probably not a good idea. That pike, you know, that pikeman, that pikeman. Um, okay. You can stay healed. You can hit him, and then everybody else can move. We'll come back, retake the city of Mainz. Pray to God the pikeman doesn't absolutely crush our hopes and dreams. And then after that, we will go for Poland proper. What is this builder doing? Okay, uh, you do that does say we're going to enter a Dark Age. Mm, the Dark Age could be a problem. Okay, you come here. There we go, for loyalty. Um, let's finish taking this city out. Thank you. There we go, Taruga's our city. I could liberate it. I'm going to keep it, though. Um, I guess I just build a library or something. I mean, emergency ends in about 18 turns. Um... I think we'll do fairly well. I think we're doing fairly well right now. Uh, we're not going to be able to go for Poland because it does look like we're going to enter a dark slash um, normal age. Uh, we are going to get a good peace deal, though. We are so much stronger than everybody else. Go for Harold Herdrada, and then I don't care Catholicism, although that might actually... Yeah, no, that's... That is a bad idea. Let's go Catholicism here so Poland gets crushed. Uh, Harold Hartrada, Confucianism. That's that's fine. That's fine. Engineering. Um. Okay. What are we gonna do next? I think let's go cartography into square rigging, into industrialization, and then after that we can just go refining, artillery, infantry, chemistry, tanks, just all the good stuff. We're gonna get all the good stuff. 
Um, here we are going to, yeah, I guess we'll go Urban Warfare. Um, yeah, you can come and do big damage. Well, you can't kill him. You're going to have to back up. And yeah, we really can't do anything right now, at least until we get the archers in place. Yeah, these horsemen get absolutely massacred by these pikemen. Ah, shit, this pikeman can actually move here next turn. I didn't notice that. Uh, everybody else keep moving. And, yeah, it's time. We, we, we have to bring him in right now. There's no other option. Who has a... Well, I guess it has to be in the city we spawned him in. We have to bring in Beowulf. We have to bring him back. It's just that simple. We're not going to be able to do anything without him. Um, well, he can actually move his first turn. I, I did not know that. I will transfer you to... Hmm. Nuremberg. Yes, and then next turn, you can... Okay, so we can use him to take out the pikemen. And you can come here. Um, horsemen can come over there. Uh, this dude can just... Can you... Yeah, just heretic. Condemn that man. Uh, everybody here can just heal, I guess. As long as Germany doesn't enter a golden age, which I don't see how they could, considering we absolutely crushed them. Um, Poland might, though. Poland, Poland, I could see them entering a golden age. That could be an issue. Yeah, just like that we... Like, that archer just got one shot by that crossbowman. It's not pretty. Um... Yeah, you go there. Uh, how much damage could you guys do? Okay, this is big, though. Right here, we can do a good amount of damage to this pikeman. I don't think we can kill him. In fact, I'm fairly certain we can't. Uh, you can move there. Bring in the warrior. You can finish him off. Okay, there's that. Um, I do want to go for the pikeman. Although, no, that's not a good idea. Let's attack there, and then you can just... You stay fortified, because Beowulf can attack next turn, and that should be more than enough. Uh, choose production. I guess we'll go for a Obelisk. I mean, these cities still need help production-wise. Uh, you come here and defend these archers, because I don't know if the AI cheats or not, and I don't want a surprise archer death again. You move here, you get a... Oh my god, they also... Okay, I thought they took out another three-promotion archer. I was about to flip. No, I'm not that stupid. I'm stupid, but I'm not that stupid. Um, I mean, I have a fairly big navy. I can afford to get these guys to go explore. And then you can just condemn another heretic, make sure they can't spread their religion, and, ooh, this city's starting to look juicy. Is everybody at war with Germany? Dude, Coupe's, are, that's why they're doing so much damage. All right, so we're definitely not going to be able to take this city because is going to control it. Um, everybody else, just keep going. We'll go next turn. Uh, wow, nobody died. That's actually surprising. Okay, uh, you run away as fast as you can. Um, I'm going to use Beowulf's challenge to knock him out. And then, boom. Um, I don't think we can take the city. Okay, that's a problem. Uh, again, we're just going to just rain fire on the Spikeman. Um, shit, okay. Uh, my defeat. Okay, that's not good. That is... You stay there and fortify... Uh, you stay there and fortify, and, like, at the very least, we can get, like, support bonuses to make sure we don't die. Um, you can actually stay fortified. Yeah, next turn, we should be able to take the city. Who needs a promotion? You do? Perfect. Uh, we'll give you coursers, and then this horseman can come over there. We're just gonna give everybody some sweet support bonuses. I'll repair that. That's a butt-ton of food in that city. Okay, unit needs orders. Unit here. I guess you could come here, I guess. Yeah, next turn. Um, damn, the caravel, is the caravel not attacking? No, okay. Uh, cartography, finally, we are going to get caravels. Kind of expensive, though, probably not immediately. Um, I guess Granada's easiest to make Suzerainov, we might as well go for them first. Again, Beowulf's challenge, knock him out of his own city, and then raid the city, like the proper Vikings we are, and oh my god. God, that city is strong as fuck. Uh, we got it, though. We got back the city of Mainz. It's fine. Poznan's got walls now. 50 combat strength. It's not worth it. We're just going to defend. Do as much damage as we possibly can. You move here so we can't attack you. Um, boom, and then boom. And then hit him. Boom. Okay. Okay. <laughs>